science, technology, engineering, arts, and mathematics. It's time to go full steam ahead with another experiment. Today we're asking the excellent question, how does an egg float? Short answer, density. Density is a measurement that compares the amount of mass an object has compared to its volume. So, it helps us to figure out how full of atoms an object is. Remember, atoms are the basic unit of matter in everything. Why does an ice cube float in a glass of water, but a rock of the same size doesn't? Because of density. The ice cube has less density than the water it is in. Less dense objects always float on top of more dense objects. Since the rock has a higher density than the water, it sinks to the bottom. Let's get started. Fill a glass halfway up with water. Now drop an egg in. Sinks to the bottom, right? Now take that egg out and add a quarter cup of iodized salt and mix well. Very slowly add in regular tap water so it doesn't mix with the salt water. Now drop the egg in again. Is the egg suspended in the middle of the glass? This is because the salt water is now more dense than the egg and the fresh water above it. This is the same reason you can more easily float in the ocean as compared to a lake. Did you also know you can tell if an egg is rotten or not using the same trick? A fresh egg will always sink to the bottom, but a rotten egg will always float. Pretty cool, huh? And it'll save you from having a very smelly omelet. Head to kittechnation.com and check out the Discovery Lab for this and other incredible experiments.